here is a licensing body, as a regulated body, and you have to meet certain requirement bef before you become a professional engineer, just like your professional practice exam requirement, your four-year design engineering experience, and you have to appear for law and ethics exam. I was aware of the licensing process in different provinces, and uh, I came initially to Quebec, so I re checked the requirements in Quebec regarding experience and education and all the process of application. That's four or five years of experience. And when I came here, all I needed was to have a one-year experience under supervision of a licensed engineer in Canada. And that's how I became eligible to apply for uh, Ontario uh, Professional Engineer License. It uh, probably took me about a year uh, to get licensing. And um, in my case, a lot of that was getting documents. And that is the biggest challenge because APEGA requires the original transcripts to be sent directly from the university. I applied for a certification with APEGEM in 1997. The whole process from registration to completing my certification took me 10 long years. So it was a combination of working full-time, studying, and looking after my children. I believe that it's all worth the wait. I'm now a registered professional engineer, and that's my dream. The most important part for anyone who comes from different countries is to get the first job, to be exposed to the job market, and find a job experience under supervision of a professional engineer. As far as you get to that stage, then it's easy to apply for different uh, uh, licenses through the country.